that trophy that Sim Du there is the trophy that the champion will receive. And uh, that's a beautiful tee shot. Thank you, guys. Chris John Versailles, no, just desperate to get his name on there, along with the great Gary Player and Bobby Locke and Sid Bruce and his brother Jock Bruce and many others. Nothing really to worry about. Swings it very much within himself. Bizarre. Now, you don't often, often see him go after one and get the extra 10 or 20 yards out of it, even on long, long par fives. That's more like it. That's more like the Christian Bissau note we used to see. Him. Yeah, the wind does some strange stuff in this. In this big basin of this extinct volcano where Sun City is. Here you go. I think there. Uh, we, we don't know which one it's going to be yet, but uh, we'll find out at the end of the day. Yeah, such a slow putt. That is beautifully hauled. Positive, aggressive putt. Going left, not too much, hopefully. Oh, it's sitting up. Breeze down off the left. He'll be going for the middle of the green. He won't be taking Go. any chances. Go. Oh, dear. I don't know if it made it. Is in the water. This is his fourth shot. Still got a chance to drop only the one shot here at the eighth. Now this is a big putt here for the Saden Hope. Oh, and he's made it. You know, that could almost, almost be better than a birdie. That I would agree, Boxy. You know, the, we all know there are moments in a, a final round if you win. Yeah, it's not easy. High ball flight required. Got to land it soft. 202 to the flag. This is a seven iron for Christian. Proceeding home. This one's got to go. This one's got to go. There's that pushed iron shot that you picked up yesterday, Dale. That seems to be his, his poor shot for the irons. Glorious. He loves it. Yeah, it's a beauty. He's staring it down. Beautiful golf shot. Wow. His short irons are amazing. They really are, aren't they? He's, he still hasn't had a birdie today, though. Well there you go. There you go. Back to even for the day. Back to 15 under par. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That'll show you, John Morgan. I've got it. Good straight man. at Good the man. fountain, straight at the fountain, could not be better. 260 yards, he's got to the front, the same hope, 284 to this right flag, into that little bit of breeze. Is everything of this? Go, 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 go. This one looking good with three words Nothing. straight at it. Man, 
right over the hole. I think that it hit it, I think. I think it lumped, jumped up in the air, didn't it? They never take that away from you, and this man knows it. And this, he knows that he must be making these putts, Oi. which he's doing so beautifully now, two in a row. Another low ball flake. John, if you can get this just over the bunker, you don't want to hit it to the back of the green, you are left with a devilishly fast putt. Okay, okay, let's do this Yeah, that's fine. I thought he might opt to just go maybe 10 or 15 feet left, but that's okay. Let's see if he can get this one right. Just look how much it's going to turn. Here it comes, here it comes, has he? He has, brilliant stuff, look at that, birdie, 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 10, 11 and 12, 17 under and he's got his five shot over knee lead back. Oh, that's a different shot for him, he's hit it out to the right. Oh. Wow. It's fine. Oh, hit the tree and straight down. Hit the tree and dropped straight down. I tell you what, that was headed for some serious trouble. Just get it somewhere on the green, Morgie. Yeah, he's got 206 yards and the pin's at the back of the green. And this has done well. Very good shot. Yeah, good putt. <laughs> very, very good. You got a putt, small, small marker or only that big one? No, only this one. So can you, you go. You go two down the hill for me, please. I think you'd pay good money to get this anywhere on the green. Fantastic. That's. He would have paid you anything for that if you'd said. Dead center of the green here, what will you give? Oh, brilliant putt. Eighth hardest hole on the course today, and the next hole is the second hardest, so be smart. Oh, man. That is just, that's fabulous. You'll keep it a bit right, it just goes straight at it. Straight at it. <laughs> Lovely. Well Beautiful putt. A wonderful birdie here at the 16th hole. And do you think, Richard, four shots is enough? I think it is now. Man of his talent. He's, you know, what a tale of two nines. And 37. No birdies, one drop shot. Soft down. Soft down, please. Should be space there. Oh, right. You've been flat. Incredible. That is incredible. I think that path actually slopes the other way as well. On his way, no problem. And there, uh, safely on. Well done to Christian Besaden Hope. I mean, what a, you know, an honour to, to win the South African Open, being South African. You think of all the names that are on there. Yeah, absolutely. And second oldest. Yeah. Get the marker out the pocket. There you go. <laughs> this is a moment he will remember for the rest of his life. Brilliant stuff from um, Christian Besaden Hope. Winner of the 110th South African Open. What a tale of two nines. Home in 32. 18 under par, he's 32 under par for the last two weeks. That's quite incredible golf on two of South Africa's finest golf courses. Brilliant stuff. He'll be up to fifth on the race to Dubai. That's his third win now on the European Tour. OK, let's get down to Dale Hayes. 
Chris John. That's two in a row. Try and describe how you feel because this is the big one. This is what you've dreamt about since you started to play the game. Yeah, I mean, it's unbelievable to stand here with a win, it's an open win. I mean, it's, it, it's any South African's dream, South African golfer's dream to, to win its national anthem, national, national tournament. Um, yeah, no, it's unreal. I've fought hard today. Front nine things didn't really go my way. Um, yeah, I, I just dug deep to to come out with a win today. 10, 11 and 12, they were the holes that, that won it for you. That was massive. Uh, I have to say that second part on, on 11 was was huge and obviously that part on 12 was a bonus. I just I just tried to got it to, to get it close inside a couple of feet and I made it so that was a bonus and I knew it. I, I just need to make make balls coming in uh, and I did it and yeah really really tough to send you as a winner. You know I don't think we should ever forget how it all started and I've got a message from Christine Hare oh. who was your golf coach when yeah. you were still at junior school. Yeah she was actually my um, like golf teacher at Waterclough High School where, where I finished off my, my uh, High school uh, career. She obviously, she obviously played a massive part in my in the golf at Waterclough and in and in my progress through the years as well. And I really appreciate all her support as well. It really, it really is an absolutely terrific win. And you know, when we watched you play the last two weeks in the last round, it was all about patience. Do you feel like that when you're actually playing, or is it a lot more going on inside you? Yeah, today was tough, especially on the front nine where where things wasn't really going my way. Uh, just tough to be to 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 be patient. Uh, my second shot on eight just just caught a gust and it and it came up short and that was a a massive bogey save as well. But yeah, I mean, my caddy said to me, just stay patient and let's just try and try and shoot under par on the back. Back nine, and uh, that that should take care of it. To watch another European tour video, click here, and to subscribe, click here.